this set of cutters right here represents pretty much what all of us use occasionally. Whether it's a camp axe, your favorite fillet knife, your deer skinner, your pocket folder, or your wife's favorite kitchen knife, sharpening these knives are always a problem for people. So I'm going to try to make it a little bit easier for you. It's really quite simple if you just follow these very, very simple precepts. The angle of any cutting implement is most practical at between 12 and 15 degrees of angle or bevel. So for myself, uh, I use to sharpen knives uh, what we call a diamond steel or some variation of a diamond steel. And what's important to get the feel of is what that 12 to 15 degrees looks and feels like as you sharpen a knife. When sharpening the knife, you always drive the point of the edge toward the sharpening device. And in your mind, think of what you want that bevel to be. As a general rule, the harder the bevel, the longer the point will last. The shallower the bevel, the sharper you can get the edge, but it doesn't last as long because it's thinner. So a happy medium is a good place to be, 12 to 15 degrees. It doesn't have to be absolutely precise. To help you get a feel for what that bevel is or what that angle is, here's a little trick that you can use. It really is helpful. Get a marker and run it along the very, very bevel of the knife on either side. And then, as you sharpen the edge, that black marker will wear away and you'll see exactly what the bevel is. come in here real close and look at this edge, you can see that I've worn away the black magic marker. And I can actually see the bevel that I have put on that knife. If you're sharpening an axe, it's a little bit different. You don't use that steel, but you still want that 12 to 15 degrees. On an axe, because of the heavy duty work that it's usually going to be doing, you might want to go to the stiffer bevel, the 15 degrees, and do the sharpening with a file instead of with the steel. Once that bevel is established, you're just dressing the knife each time you, you refurbish the point. You're not grinding that angle again. So if that angle already exists on the edge of the knife, you're just refreshing it every time you sharpen. So invest in a good file. This is a Lure Jensen. If you want to go in line, check on. I use this same file to sharpen my broadheads on my arrows. Uh, or a real good medium coarse sharpening diamond steel. Restaurant supplies have these things. It's the best investment you'll ever make in your cutlery.